So today we have a very special guest, uh, a friend of mine, Dimitris Skiatis, uh, who I met two years ago now in Berlin when you were speaking at the Affiliate World Conference. And right away, I, I knew this guy was uh, just a good vibes factory. Uh, what I didn't know at the time until I actually saw him speak was that he's also a high level Google Analytics expert. Start by telling me you know, how you've come to, to where you are today, traveling from Greece, what, a 30 hour flight here oh. to Atlanta <laughs> to, to, to join us here, so. Almost, and you know, we are, as Greeks, we can be really, really emotional, so I don't like to cry on camera. So anyways, uh, I come from a background that uh, I'm Greek, born and raised, I've been there all my life, and I love my country. And I love the people there, but there's one really big, uh, I wouldn't say disadvantage, but there's one thing that I never liked. Like the mentality of the people is like, go to school, get good grades, like go to college, uh, then go get a good job. And then when you're 65, you can enjoy life. And I was always like, really? So I took the leap of faith. I quit my job after I attended an event in, uh, in Florida. And then how do you know Greece again played a super big important role, uh, role in my life where capital controls happened. So it meant that we, can't, we couldn't really take money out of the bank. I couldn't run any Facebook ads, no Google ads. For three months in a row, I was making zero dollars per month. But then I said, you know what? I was with my back against the wall. I said, I need to do something. So I had that good skill uh, that I was running the Google AdWords campaigns and blah, 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 uh, all these kind of good things. And I pick up the phone and I was so anxious to say that, hey, you know what? I have this agency and I want to run these ads for you. So I started looking for jewelry, uh, irons, whatever jerseys. And I would start to see mistakes in their ads. So I would call them and say, hey, I'm really interested in that jersey. By the way, you have a mistake in your ad. They were like, Oh really? This is why you called me? No, 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 I, this is not the reason why I called you, but yeah, obviously that was the reason. So I got my first client for 250 bucks per month and then I got the next one and the next one. I realized that I was really good at what I was doing, like teaching others and helping others. So that was the break point when I started realizing that I have to jump in the groups. I started asking, uh, I started answering all the questions from uh, people inside the group. Then people invited me to webinars. I started making free videos, podcasts, interviews. And that was the moment where people actually started inviting me to events to speak. So I went from this really normal guy, super normal guy, not believing in himself. And for the past three years, I've been traveling the world. I've been meeting awesome people. So God bless the internet and Facebook. Like, yeah, <laughs> that's really it. It's, it's one of my superpowers, looking at data. And I never look at data as like something boring because I got to give you an example, right? I was working with this, uh, this big agency in Greece. We were working with really, really big brands. We had the clients spending 300,000 per month on Google AdWords, right? And I started analyzing the campaigns and blah, 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 and started seeing keywords. We were spending with per, per month $3,000 on keywords and campaigns that would never convert. Like 3,000 on the $300,000 is just 1%, but it's still three grand. Three grand on the course of a year on campaigns that will never worth it. 36 grand. You can buy a brand new car. Yeah. Why do you need to spend money on the things that you don't, that um, they don't make sense. They will never convert. When people are, and this is the biggest mistake, believe it or not, the biggest mistake I've seen is that when people start and they're getting that initial sale, say they're looking for another guy. No. Like the guy, he just paid you money. He just make sure that you give him an amazing customer experience and make sure you, you, uh, you turn him into a customer for life. That's your biggest mistake. Like stop treating the guys like money in versus money out. For the people who are already in game and they have a really good mindset, they're really motivated to make them understand that they're stop leaving money on the table. Honestly, I see it all day long. This is one of my superpowers. I can go ahead and tell you, bro, you need to do this, this, and this, and this, and I put my sign on it. Guys, I'll make analytics sexy, I promise. I'll, I'll try, I'll, okay, I'll try my best. <laughs> nice, <laughs> very good. Well, thanks again. Awesome, thank all you. All right. Thank you. Cheers.